Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel for some more WWE Supercard Season 6. So, I left you not too long ago. Told you I had a pro from TBG, Ricochet. Wasn't that long ago, was it? I've been playing my bot off in wild mode. And he's ready. He's ready to pro. I didn't throw him in the performance center at all. I literally just played wild mode. Literally. Yeah, I've been a... Bit of a naughty boy staying up this late, but, you know, potential Vanguard freebie. Potential LP pack. Maybe, we'll see. Just want to double check I am recording. Bear with me a sec. I am. It would seem that I am recording, which is awesome. So, let's just make sure... Oh, he's actually in the deck. Awesome. Right then, let's do this, guys. We're going to combine him. Okay, so that alone won't do anything, obviously, because that is still weaker than a Vanguard. So, as I'm recording this... I just gave away a page there, haven't I? Um, season 1 Loyalty Fusion. I'll make sure... That I put that in before you come to this bit. So, yeah. So, Ricochet's done. He's leveled. He's proed. So, I've got, what? Six cards? I mean, is that going to do anything? Not really. <laughs> uh, see, I was a little bit silly. Because I used my Rey Mysterio SummerSlam 19 Fusion to train... Uh, the final part of Ricochet, but realised now that was probably a silly thing to do because it had been a good idea for me to use him now. But have I got anything that I could possibly use? I mean, there's only one card that's just looking out at me saying, just sacrifice me. I mean, do I use any of these maybe? I mean, I could. I think I'm going to use a couple of these Day 5 Fusions. That seems the best thing to do. Right then. Come on. Vanguard freebie. Can we do it? Can we? No, not quite. Because that is only just... Blow that's only just better than a vanguard, uh, a single vanguard. Oh, it's barely moved it. It's not even moved it at all. He's not even made it in. Oh, my God. I'm quite disappointed. But saying that, we are still a fair few levels off. So... I think we do the other two. I know this is a bit of a kick in the bollocks because I got these... Uh, you know what, screw it, I'm going to do the Batista as well. I know this sort of interferes with what I've been doing with the um, fusion chamber and stuff, but, you know, at this point, does it really matter that much? So, we'll do them too. Is that going to do anything? Puts it to level 88, okay. Now, I don't know if the Shattered Batista is going to do anything else. It'll probably level up a little bit, but not much. Level 92. Has it moved the bar much? No, not at all. Ah, oh, you know what? This video might be for nothing in the end. I was almost convinced that I was going to get this. But then again, there are a lot of stats that come late on. You know what? I wasn't going to do this. I've just got to... I'll just use Gulag. I've just got to get this done. I'm sorry, Drew. I did want to keep you. Oh, you only put me to level 100. My God. Well, he's now better than Sting. He's not even better than Mick Foley. But if you look at the stats on Cena, he absolutely... Oh, well, well to be fair. Oh, because Mick's got... Ah, oh, don't forget the momentum slot as well. So that, I mean, it's not even moved. Right. One more sacrifice. One more. 
Drew's gone. I'm not using an LMS card. I'm not using any of the ones that can be trained. Do we use Miz or Shelton from the chamber? I think I'll do that. And this should take him out, take him to full. You've got to be kidding me. Right, we'll play a few games and then we will have a look. Because that for me, you know what, that's barely moved. You know what, screw it. I cannot be bothered to play another game. I've played so many games. I just want this to be done. Let's get rid of Miz. Realise I'm probably going to get a little bit of hate in the comments for using these cards to, tr to train them up. But, I mean, look at it, guys. I mean, it's crazy how many bloody cards it takes to train them up. Right, so that's Ricochet done. It has not put me in Vanguard. It is... I mean, it's barely moved at all. I mean... I expected... Uh, uh, are you actually kidding me? That pro is not better than the Mick Foley single Vanguard. But saying that, Ricochet's not in a momentum slot. So let's do that. Let's autofill that. No, I mean, that can't be right, surely. Right, so he gets him in power. He, Ricochet wins in toughness. Ricochet wins in speed. Ricochet wins in... So, right, swap, swap, ricochet, there you go, right, so, I'm obviously going to go off and log back on the game, so I'll see you in a sec, well we're back guys and it's not done anything, it's put me very close to Vanguard, <laughs> But I'm still a whisker away. So, uh, I am really disappointed in that. I expected to be a lot closer than that. I expected to be in Vanguard, if I'm honest. Let's change them over. I will quickly check the team deck as well. Spoiler alert, if you didn't see last video, we did get the card. Um, let's have a look at the deck. But I mean, they're almost midway in Primal Plus Plus, so that's pretty good. Oh, I was so hoping I was going to get it. Oh, I am really disappointed. I feel a bit bad now for using those cards. As you can see, Alexa's fully trained up. See, that's what got me thinking that, you know, getting to work on Ricochet will uh, do something for me. But it wasn't to be. So, uh... Yeah, um, I hope you have enjoyed this video, guys. If you have, please make sure you leave a big thumbs up and do subscribe for more WWE Supercard Season 6 videos. Uh, thank you for watching. Um, let me know your thoughts on this in the comments, and I will see you in the next one. And uh, goodbye for now. <laughs>